Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Bob's Pistols and Pay Dirt. A little bit different format today. I've done the entire video, I started to edit it, and guess what? My microphone was not attached firmly to the camera, and most of the video is me almost talking. Basically talking, but you can't hear me. So, what the video is on is Miner's Depot. Uh, a while back I got some Miner's Depot and I'll tell you which bag it is. I think they just have one bag. There we go. Our famous Digger's Delight Pay Dirt multiple sizes. The Pay Dirt starts at 20 bucks a bag and goes up to $10,000. That must be a really big bag. Anyway, I'm gonna film the front here the, the, the panning part's just going to have some music. I had some really important words of wisdom, uh, you know, wisdom bombs that I dropped during the panning here and there, and they all will get edited out. So sorry we don't have that intellectual content for you today. <laughs> but uh, I'll go ahead and refilm this intro for it. You can watch a little bit of the panning. I'll kind of speed that up. And then at the end, uh, I'll do the, the closing properly with, with sound, with volume, with me talking. And uh, uh, also at the end, one, uh, oh yeah, yeah. One of the things that I wanted to talk to you all about is, and for you viewers who subscribe, et cetera, you probably caught onto this. I kind of have a tendency to leave a bunch of pictures at the end of my videos. And basically those are travel pictures. Uh, last uh, video I did, I had a hat that said Italia. And I dropped in a bunch of photographs uh, uh, with uh, Michael, Michelangelo, um, just a lot of stuff from, from Italy. And anyway, at the end of this video is going to be the Big Bend area of Texas, down by Terlingua. Um, very far southern Texas, it's really different. Texas is huge. And, you know, maybe if you've never been there before, you might be interested in, in seeing what it looks like there in south Texas. So. Uh, it was a really fun trip, did it on a motorcycle, it was a good time. So the other thing I want to say is, please do me a favor, y'all, subscribe to the channel. We're getting tons of likes, thousands of uh, views and this type of stuff, but I really am trying to grow the subscribers. So I'd really appreciate your help if you could just hit the sub subscribe button. And, uh, and that would mean a lot to me. So anyway, without further ado, we'll have the silent video part with some music, some new music and uh, then we'll close it at the end. Thanks so much. See you in a bit. Miner's Depot Pay Dirt. Let's see it in the pan. Nice. All right. Let's get this puppy open. See what it looks like. Look around and see if we see any gold. Pay Dirt's really dusty. You'll see a little dust popping out here. Um, and just looking through it, didn't see any visible gold to start with, so... A little concerning, but uh, I think it turns out pretty good at the end. So here we've gone ahead and classified it down. Uh, it's plus and minus kitchen strainer, and it's almost equal amounts. Um, maybe a little bit more in the plus kitchen strainer, but look at the dirt. I mean, it's all panable. There's no giant huge rocks, so really excited to have some fun with this dirt. All right, got my pay dirt here, both pieces of pay dirt. I got my 29 round classifier, green tips. Got my coffee here, still steaming a little bit. Got my little panning kit set up, water's all set up. So let's get going. There's quite a bit of dirt to pan. So I'm probably going to abbreviate some of the panning stuff today, but uh, I'll tell you, I'm really looking forward to this. I've never ordered from this company before, Miner's Depot, but they do seem to get really good reviews. So, um, yeah, let's get going. Let's get started. We're going to start with some of these bigger stuff. See if we find anything off the bat. It's not as muddy as I thought it was going to be. I think we'll use these medium rifles. Oh, 
I like the fact that of this bag, every bit of it is pannable. You're not picking out a bunch of uh, giant rocks. Now let's see if we got anything in the first pan. Zero. Nada. All right, we'll keep it going. Quite a bit of little organics floating around here. And now we'll try some of the small stuff. I'm glad the pay dirt is very dry. This is quite a bit uh, muddier. More of a cappuccino look to it. Yep. This has got to be Arizona dirt. Arizona dirt with Alaskan gold. Got a pretty good little chunky bit there and some other pieces over here. So yeah, not bad. Let's keep going.
Okay, just finishing up the panning here. Notice the last pan, we've got a really nice little line of gold. Let's take a minute and look at all of it in the pan. Beautiful, beautiful big pieces. Yep. Putting it on the scale, weighing it out. Exactly eight point or excuse me, point eight six five. All right, how bad? All right, I really do thank you all for watching the video. Uh, now it's just time for the return on investment and a little bit about the pay dirt. Get my notes here. I purchased this from Miners, this right here from Miners Depot, March 26th of 2021. On that date, the uh, uh, spot price of gold was $1,728.90, making a gram of gold worth $55.60. So 0.865 gram of gold is what we recovered. Gives that gold a value of $48.09. So the return on investment was 96.2% return on investment. Man, I think it's a it's a great bag of pay dirt. What's really impressive about this pay dirt is a lot of the pay dirt, virtually, I'll put it this way, virtually all the pay dirt that you purchase from different vendors or that I have purchased from different vendors there's always a lot of larger rocks that obviously there's not going to be a five ounce gold nugget and it's just a big old five ounce rock so I end up pulling out a bunch of I call it filler material and then you get down to the amount that you actually get to pan and have fun with 100 percent of this bag was panable and that's what made it a lot of fun there were some pickers in there there was some nice sized flakes and there was some very, very fine gold. I realized that the fine gold, it takes an awful lot of it before you ever accumulate any weight. I realized that, but just the point that it had the very fine gold in it and teased you to really work your pan hard and it just made it a lot more interesting and more fun and more exciting. So hats off to Miner's Depot. Uh, I think it's just an absolutely fantastic bag of pay dirt. All right, well, that's my review. Hope you enjoy it. Following along is going to be some pictures of Big Bend uh, State Park, the Big Bend area of Texas, and maybe a little bit into Mexico. Made a little trip over to Mexico as well. So enjoy every, uh, every moment of the, every day. And as always, happy trails. See you on the next one. Nothing like a good T-bone.